Hey guys, it's Gay Gay. Welcome back to my channel. This is today's look. A really playful pink and purple beat. You know I got to have that color. So if you're interested in how I did this look, just stay tuned, watch the video, hit like, and hit subscribe. Let's be people. Let's get to know each other. Leave some comments, some nice ones. Don't be so crazy. And I hope you do enjoy the video. Sweet child of mine. Going in with the professional primer. Put a little on the back of my hand and we're going to put that all over the face. And that's what we're using for the primer today. So what is going on in these COVID streets, peoples? I hope everyone is safe. Wearing your mask, six feet, well, as much as you possibly can. Because, um... Oh, Lord. It's no joke out here. Oh, sweet child of mine. Oh, 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 sweet child of mine. And we are going in with some brows. This color is a little bit more reddish brown. I'm going to try it out and see. I want to lighten up these... Um, brows because the older you get that black and deep deep brown just looks more and more harsh and I have to try to soften up this because oh I, I just must go now sweet where do we go now all right we're gonna take the Mac uh, full coverage foundation and I'm gonna use that for to clean up my brows What y'all know about that sweet child of mine? And slash on the guitar. Oh my goodness, Becky. Shut the front door because he brought the house down. Where do we go? I swear we had the best music in the 80s. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Back in black. Back. All right, so we're going into the Violet's palette, Juvia's Place, and I'm going to take, the, and I'm taking this deep purple, and I'm just placing that in my crease right above my fold. So when I do my cut crease, the purple will show. And this is going to be a purple and pink look. I know October is breast cancer week and breast, cancer, breast cancer unfortunately runs in my family. My mom has it. I've had a sister that had it and it's uh, yeah, it's very important to us. And the purple, well, cuz I just want to do purple. You know what I'm saying? That's all. And then I'm going to go into this lighter purple right here and just place that over on top of the first purple I'll lay down. I'm going to cut the crease with the LA Girl Pro Concealer, some on the back of the hand, flathead brush. Just dipping it in there. And we're going to proceed to cut the crease. Oh, halfway there. All right, Juvia's Place, Zulu, Shaka. And I'm going to take this color here and place that in the inner corner. And it's like a, ooh, it's like a goldish pink. Ooh, it's coming up really gold, though, because of the base I laid down. But that's cool, too. That's cool. All righty, my people. So we're going to go into the Violet's Palette, Juvia's Place, and... I'm going to try this color here and just see how it looks. I'm going to put a little on my finger and let's just see if we're going to be able to mesh this together. 
How is that looking? Is that looking like, like what? I'm thinking, no. So no, I'm just gonna put this here on this side because whenever I do something, even if it's a mistake, I go ahead and do it on the other side too. So when I do correct it, it looks similar. That make any sense to y'all? Yeah, but I'm gonna go ahead and stick with that. Yeah, with that pink. I'm not gonna try to put that purple in there because it's looking not how I want it. So I'm gonna go in and finish up this eye, half of this eye with the pink, and then I'll go in back into the Juvia's palette with that deep, deep purple. Righty, I'm back into the Juvia's Place palette. The back into the Juvia's Place palette and I'm using the violet palette, this purple here, and I'm just going to place that on the outer corner and I'm going to deepen that up. I may put some black there to really deepen it up the way I want it to be. And yeah, that's pretty much the eye. Going into the James Charles palette and I'm taking this really light pink it may look more washed out on camera and I'm just gonna hit my edges here to soften them up just a little use the air condition on because it's hot and I'm taking this purple here and I'm going right in my crease above my crease and I'm just blending. I'm blending two different purples and that really light pink. Okay, so I went in with the James Charles palette just to add this purple right here and I added it between the pink and the deep purple to give it a little extra poppy pop you know what I'm saying just a little extra something something and so I don't know if my lights I tried to dim them so they would show up anyway okay so we're gonna use these magnetic lashes lashes my sister sent me some lashes some magnetic lashes I never tried them before so that's what we're gonna be using today so I'm either I'm gonna choose from either these three because you know I'm extra and I, it may be between these two um and so I'm going to go ahead and place my liner all over and then I'm going to use the magnetic liner to um so they will stick I'm going in with uh, this new mascara I picked up from MAC the Giga what is this Giga Black Lash Extended so let me see how this does And that's a no for me. It's going to take too much time to build that up. So I'm going to go in with my L'Oreal Voluminous. Okay, so the magnetic lashes. I'm going to go in with these. I think I'm going to go in with these little wispy looking ones. Oh, no. Anyway, but this is the liner. So I never read directions. I just, <laughs> I'm all at it. But I'm just going to go ahead and place this liner on top of my... Oh, okay. Maybe I'll put too much. I should have read the directions and not threw them away so I would know how long to let this sit. That, well, I need to let it dry. Okay, so... We place that there. Dang, why I throw them directions away? Hard headed. I'll place this on top of my liner. Okay. What's popping? You dropping. 
Coming in with the Pro Primer. I think we're gonna do black eyeliner today. Let's give this a deep, sultry look. And as I'm putting this here, I'm thinking to myself, I should have went with white liner. Oh well, too late. Yeah, that's what we're doing hey, now. The moment of truth. So these are the lashes that I'm going with. This is what it looks like. I don't know. Can you see it or what? Okay, it's got little little magnetic things on there. So this is what we're, let's go ahead and put this on. Ooh, all right, come on. Ooh, oh, okay. Okay, so that's that's it. Wait a minute, wait a minute, get in there. Okay, yeah, I'm liking that. Yeah, yes, yes, honey, honey, yes. Okay. I'm going with the foundation, and I'm going to use the YSL, and I'm going to mix it with the uh, Tarte Extraordinaire. For mine with the Tarte, I'm going to go in with the Juvia's Place and mix those the two air together. air condition, guys, and we are just going to go ahead and place our foundation. I was thinking of something I forgot. I don't know if it was a new foundation I wanted to try. I ain't been getting much sleep, so it's really hard for me to think. Oh, goodness. Okay, so I'm going in with the MAC Full Coverage Foundation, and I'm going to use that as my concealer. Excuse my lights. I don't even know what happened. But I'm going with the L'Oreal Infallible. And I'm going to place some of that right on top of that MAC. And let's work it from there. Yeah, honey. Oh, Lord, I just had an anxiety attack. <sighs> Help me, Jesus. Okay. Okay, so now we are doing... Our contour. Oh yeah, let me bring this up into here. Alrighty, so now we're gonna blend out this contour. Excuse that noise. My neighbors are on it tonight. Oh my goodness. They don't never put that kid to bed before ten o'clock. In with MAC setting powder and soft yellow and I'm gonna set my under eyes. Going in with MAC Studio Fix in NC 47 and I'm just gonna take that all over my face to set it. Okay, let's go ahead and do the bronzing and contouring with the Winky Lux. Okay, MAC blush, right on the apples of my cheeks. Come back into the violet palette and we're gonna take um, this purple and this purple and work under the eyes. No, that's prettier. I'm going to go into this purple and work under the eyes. Going in with this color here. On my inner, co inner corner. I don't know why I do my mouth like that. 
and all that when I'm putting on makeup like that makes a difference but for me I guess it does gonna take this liner and line my lips We're taking this MAC lipstick and we're going to use that and then I'm going to go into the UMA now I don't highlight because I have moles and when you highlight it brings out so I'm not trying to bring out but I love this highlighter so I'm just gonna place it on my nose and <sighs> my forehead and things like that cuz I just I just love this little highlighter. Oh my goodness, I love it. And I just can't do a makeup look right now without it. Now next month, I probably won't even remember I have it, but this month, <gasps> we're glowing. Okay guys, and this is the completed look. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. Please hit like, hit subscribe. Let's be peoples. And I will holler at you.